Screw the newest fashion, we're fusing passion and enthusiasm. Seat belts fasten as we soar across the hugest chasms. I said, screw the newest fashion, we're fusing passion and enthusiasm. Seat belts fasten as we soar across the hugest chasms. Whew. So I'm feeling excited to be alive and enthusiastic, and I felt like sharing a little bit of this in a YouTube video. This video is all about the the acronym called VAST, V-A-S-T, which stands for Visioning, Assessment, Strategy, and Timeline. And for me, the VAST model has been very helpful in manifesting the dreams that I want to dream. I feel like I'm, I'm living a dream right now and it's because I've been able to vision the, the future that I want and then assess and then strategize, set out a timeline, and then turn the ideal into the real deal. So just some helpful things that have really helped me is um, some teachings from Wayne Dyer. He talks about how um, you really need to imagine the future that you want to live in order to really bring it into existence. And so many of us are scared to kind of aim for the stars and we're told like, oh, you need to, you need to stay grounded, you can't really brainstorm, but I encourage you to just brainstorm like crazy, get super excited, dream the craziest dream you can imagine, and if you shoot for the stars, you can still land on the moon. And um, really, we just need to envision the future we want and, and put strategic steps in line using the vast model as a permaculture concept um, where you just assess your different factors things that you would need to to manifest that vision and then you strategize how are you gonna do this you start doing steps and then you set out a timeline to actually bring that from the ideal into the real deal which I'm still very much working on one of the things that gets in in my way is is worrying and my friend recently told me worrying is praying for what you don't want. And I think we underestimate how powerful our own thoughts are. And when we're constantly worrying about these futures that, that we don't want, we're kind of giving energy to them. But if we do positive thinking and actually are constantly envisioning and putting thought, mental energy into the vision that we want, then we're putting steps in front of us to actually get there and um, Wayne Dyer talks about if you have like a fork in the road you have two possible options one is way better one is you want way more than the other one why would you but you don't know which future is actually gonna come why would you spend time envisioning what the unfortunate one is like say you're um, say you're waiting to hear back on whether you passed your test whether you got a good grade on your test I mean regardless of what you're gonna get you might as well uh, put energy or maybe that's not a good example but something something where the outcome is not very sure instead of constantly putting energy and praying for what you don't want by worrying imagine the best possible future you could ever ever want and then you're just adding mental energy towards that possible manifestation because I think reality is pretty malleable and mutable and viable and pliable. Rea or I like to say reality is malleable and mutable and valuable and suitable. <laughs> Anyways, I'm just excited to be alive. I'm, I'm here in Los Angeles. Um, there's I just discovered a new tree over there foraging. That's a date palm tree. It drops these delicious fruits on the ground. They taste a lot like persimmons. And um, it's really just a beautiful place here, LA. Um, there's all kinds of stuff going on. I just posted a video from the Learning Garden. That's really cool. Um, but scoobly doo ba doo, I encourage you to use the vast model and really just seize your dreams like the time is now 
I got in a little uh, fender bender the other day with my friend and it, it just snapped me back into when I was hit by the car and had the near death experience. And I was just like, holy shit, my life could have ended right there. You know, like any day could be our last day. It goes really fast. Um, so it's kind of like this paradox where we can, we're gonna end from this, melt from this world anyway. So you might as well seize the moment and make it the best you can. That's my, that's my opinion at least. So thank you for watching. Please check out the links. I encourage you to implement the VAST model. It is very helpful. Visioning, assessing, strategizing, and timelining. <laughs> my name is Philosophical. Thanks for watching. Peace.